In this video, I'm gonna demonstrate how to make tie outs on any tarp. Let's say you have a tarp with a busted grommet or you have a tarp like we made this one last week. It has no tie outs whatsoever. All you're gonna use is an acorn and some bait line. And we have some bait line here. And first we're gonna tie an overhand knot, just like so. Now we're gonna make a loop and we're gonna do it just like we did that overhand knot, just like that. And we're gonna leave this loop in here. Now let me show you what we're going to use the acorn for. All right, now we're going to take our acorn and slide it on the back side of this material. This works with any tarp. Now take your slip knot that we made and slide it over the acorn and just tighten it down. Just like that. So now we can tie this off anywhere and it will secure our tarp. Now, if you do this on all four corners, you don't need grommets inside your tarp. Now, securing your tarp in this fashion seems to work a lot better than grommets do. High winds can rip the grommets out. So, doing it with this, you're grabbing the fabric so it's less likely to rip it out. Now, let's get this tarp set up and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, so this is about as far out as I want to go. So we're gonna do a Marline spike hitch here. Just like that. Pull it down like that. Now, that's good and secure. Let's get the other three sides. I do realize we're on a hill. This is for demonstration purposes only. I'm not camping here tonight. Now you can use this on any tarp. It could be a canvas tarp, a plastic tarp. It could be a bed sheet that we made into a waterproof tarp. And this has no grommets whatsoever. So we had to come up with a way to tie this thing down. You don't have to use just acorns. You can use a little bit of dirt. You can use a stick. You can use a wad of leaves. You can use anything to make an area there to where that knot will hold on to it. Hey, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like, follow, share. I'll see you next time. God bless you.